I like to grab videos from here and there that you might not have seen before and give some people an opportunity to get information um, like Simon Parks here. Uh, he talks about how they were going to do the shutdown, but they decided not to. Well, we have big thing happened in, in Britain and the mainstream media hardly covering it. Um, our number one uh, railroad station, uh, we call it a railway station here, but the number one station, the premier station, the whole of the United Kingdom, the biggest station is called Victoria Station. And they've just closed it for two weeks. Just, um, just like that. what they've said is, oh, it's a COVID thing, um, but no other station is closed. Uh, and we know that there was a, a real hard push for a lockdown in Britain before Christmas. The bad guys wanted that. They didn't get it. And we know that the good guys were similarly looking for a lockdown for different reasons from about the 27th onwards. And, but it looks like they've decided that they would rather just close that railway station than close the whole country, which would have just been a distraction to try to hide what they were really doing. So they've just gone for the obvious and they've, they've literally closed the number one station. Um, they say it's going to be closed for two weeks. I personally, Steve, think that there are underground tunnels that connect to uh, House of Parliament, the, the big lawmaking centre, and to, to, to the Queen's residence. And I think something very big is going on to close the railway station. I myself, a long time ago when I lived in Brighton and I worked in London, it was a, a 50 minute train train journey. And so many of us from that part of the country would go into London, work and go home again. I'll do it now. Crazy. Something going on. And did you know that we're already switched to the gold standard that our dollar is backed by gold and soon they're going to back uh, soon they're going to change all of the money to one to one. It's very interesting. See it on his page. I'm not knowledgeable about this, but it, here's a little snippet and then check the rest out on Simon Parks on BitChute. Um, feedback I'm getting through my sources out of the out of Canada, the United States, and uh, um, England, outside mm. of you and Charlie and I, um, tell me that the new federal dollar, the new federal currency for the United States, gold back is on the presses and we're going to see a fiat based on gold standard which i guess it wouldn't even be fiat essentially because it's backed by gold and that we should start to see the transition the announcement of transition in early january so obviously to me this is folks this is incredible because this is the stability that qfs needs this is the